Hello friends! Welcome to my channel, or back to my channel, as the case may be. Today we are on day number 40 of our 1001 Tarot spreads. This one is called the Life Journey Spread. It is for when you need a little help identifying the people in your life who's helpful, who's a hindrance, who should I be looking for. Or you can turn this inward and say, who did I used to be? Who did I used to be that was helpful? Who did I used to be who was not helpful? What traits of myself should I be looking to develop? You can kind of do it in these two ways. That being said, let's get into it. For this reading, we will once again be using the Wizard's Tarot. And this one's a little different. Because we're talking about people and human attributes, we are only going to be using the 16 court cards. I have already separated them out uh, to make this recording easier. <clears throat> so the first card is who am I or what situation am I in currently? It's kind of hard to know where you're going if you don't know where you currently are. Card number two, what will help me or who will help me at this moment? So if you're thinking of external people, it would be what person. If you're thinking internally, what traits will help me at this moment? Card number three, what will hinder or who will hinder my journey? Card number four is what should I be aiming for? What is my aspiration of what to become? So let's, it's always harder to shuffle just, just, smaller portions, but we will do our best. So we have just the 16 face cards here, or I shouldn't say face cards, the court cards. There we go. So card one, page of pentacles, page two, knight of cups, three king of wands, and four page of wands. Okay. So card number one being the page of wands. Where are we right now? Who am I right now? The beginning of family or social type life experiences. I love how I said it was wands, but the first one is pentacles. Wands is later. They're both in this. So yeah. So <laughs> page of pentacles, home life. You are beginning to set things up on how you want your life to be. Finding joy in those experiences. Looking for how exactly you want your life to be. Your likes, your dislikes. Card number two, who or what can help you at this moment? We have the Knight of Cups. Knights are typically messengers. I'm sorry, pages are typically messengers. Knights are typically changes. They are agents unto themselves. Being cups, that is emotions. Being reversed, it is instead of something new that will be helping you at this time, it's something you already know. It's something you've already experienced. Allow that more mature experience of the emotion to guide you at this time. Card number three, King of Wands. The King of Wands is, he is the logical archetype. He knows what he has available to him, and he always seeks to make the most logical, most immediately beneficial choices without causing any long-term like negative effects. This is the person who will hinder you. This is the behavior that will hinder you. Being logical is, is good, but as the card immediately previous to it was about emotions, balance those two things. Allow your emotions to guide you through the logic process. Because logic by itself, you can justify a lot of horrible things. That your emotions will give you the conscience to say, ooh, I don't want to do that. Because you can, 
see the emotional consequences. You can see the damage it can cause to your relationships, to the people around you. So card number four, the goal or what type of person do you want to be? I find it fascinating that it's another wands card, that it's paired with what will get in the way, particularly because this is the page of wands. Pages are typically messengers. They are the young, the youthful, the inexperienced, but simultaneously the joyful. They revel in the new experiences. This is the person who is so enchanted with figuring things out that they keep learning. They don't assume that they have all the answers. They have that childlike wonder to continue seeking and learning. I think that's a pretty good goal to be a perpetual learner, to keep that youthful energy of wonder alive. So that concludes this reading of the life journey spread. Who am I? Where am I going? Type concepts. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like, comment, and if you really liked it, feel free to subscribe. Until next time, walk in the light, my friends. Bye!